So you might be in a situation where the front camera of your Samsung Galaxy phone just isn't working. Maybe the back camera is working, but your front camera for some reason just isn't working at all. Now, the very first thing I'd recommend doing here for the most part is just going through and seeing if you can just quickly kind of switch back and forth. So if you're in the camera application like this, you might just want to go ahead and see if you can flip the camera back and forth, maybe tap this camera icon back and forth a couple of times, and you want to see if that ends up fixing the problem. For a lot of people, a basic thing like that might end up fixing it, and that might be all you're going to have to do here. So flip that camera back and forth, then you want to see if that ends up fixing it. Now another thing you can try doing is to restart your phone. So hold down the buttons you normally would to restart your device. You may want to go and see if you can go and do that. So hold down the buttons you normally would to restart your phone, give it a few seconds, see if that ends up fixing the problem. And you would kind of be surprised at how often something like that could end up fixing the problem. So restart your phone, power cycle it, and you want to see if that ends up doing it. If that still doesn't end up doing it, the other thing you may want to try doing is to go ahead, make your way over into your settings application like this. You want to scroll down until you see software update, which is right here. So tap into software update. And then what you want to do is you want to click on download and install. So click on that download and install button. And all you're going to want to do here is you want to go ahead and see if there's a new update available for your phone. A lot of times, all there's going to be is just a little bit of an update. So all you want to do here is update your phone and you want to see if that ends up fixing it. And like I said, for a lot of people, that might end up fixing it for you. Now, if that still doesn't end up doing it, the other thing you may want to try doing here too is to see if you can go through and, you know, if you can contact Samsung to see if they can fix the problem. There's another way to fix it. But those are kind of the main ways to go and do it for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that'll mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so then.